today we are unboxing the Quantum Industries GTX01 triple guitar case. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, it's upside down. So it's got a little cover over it, which is really nice. Oh, it's wrapped again. This is awesome. All right. So this is the case totally unboxed. Pretty solid. Straps to lock the guitars in up here. The adjustable foam here for the different stuff, headstock lengths. Things to be bolted in. Cool. Put some guitars in it and see how it looks. Now the door should fit with no issues at all. I say having the Velcro packs is nice because you can slap them kind of wherever on the case. Get two of those. Alright, so now it's loaded up. Three guitars of normal size. Seems pretty solid. It's like a light plastic material, but it feels really durable because you have the stainless steel latches. The corners. It's also an aluminum truss bar. So as you guys can see, there's four TSA locks, two on each side, and a standard lock. It's got wheels. It's got a handle on top and a handle on the side. So you can kick it and wheel it, just like another case. That's the back. So it seems like this is less likely to get scratched and dinged up than some of the other case materials that we see on there. We'll open it back up and uh, see how they look. And they're exactly in place. So I'd say this is worn and secure to take out no matter where you are. So like I said, these are the dehumidifier packs that come with it. You feel these are one of the pouches and it helps to retain moisture and humidity while traveling. We have the accessories pouches that you can fit all your strings, picks, capo, slides, whatever. And then these are the strapped cable locks here. And you tie them to the metal poles here to keep the headstocks in place, which is good for flight as well. So what are my final thoughts on the case? Well, as someone who's been using the Enki case for about a year now, I can say that I like the design and approach of this case very much. The headstock lock system seems to work pretty well. And I like the fact that it's just about the same weight as the Anki case, but it can fit an additional guitar. As we can see, only grip that I have with it so far is the fact that my headless guitar, the Vader, doesn't quite properly sit in the foam cutout, but I know that that will be amended because one of the bonuses that you get with the case is additional foam inserts to prevent the bodies from colliding with each other, and then smaller cutouts for the headstocks since you know every guitar is gonna be a little bit different. So I feel that once I receive those, everything will be set to go. I am looking forward to taking out this case and the guitars that are in it right now on the road with my bands, Triple Addiction and Evolution X. Until next time, be sure to hit that subscribe button, like, leave a comment, you know, the whole dance around YouTube's algorithms. Until next time, keep on practicing and stay safe.